Hi, I won the $25,000 scholarship for this. I remember seeing uh, a documentary where they talked about after the natural disaster the tsunami in Japan, the damaged nuclear power plant there, there was a competition where different groups uh, built robots that would be sent into the power plant to, you know, help sort of get it under control. It was something I think that was got me more interested in robotics. So for my project, I made a robotic hand and this sensing glove. And basically, um, as an operator wears the glove and moves their hand, the robotic hand will copy exactly what they do, which makes it really intuitive and easy to control the robotic hand. It has lots of applications, but particularly for search and rescue or uh, emergency sort of operations. I did this when I was still in middle school, so I was in eighth grade, so that qualified me to compete in Washington, D.C. The winner of the Samueli Foundation Prize is from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Thomas Alden. I got the uh, top award, which uh, included $25,000 for use in you know, your education in the future. And I think that, I mean, to definitely put most of that toward college and then savings for college. In terms of what I want to study for future, for, in the future, uh, obviously I'm interested in robotics and engineering, and I think that I definitely might go into that. Um, I've also become more interested recently in physics as well, so I think I might um, pursue that. Definitely a science engineering related field.